Meghan Markle is allegedly not popular in a lot of circles, according to royal expert Angela Levin, following claims the new mum was labelled as Duchess Difficult by royal staff. But E! News royal correspondent Melanie Bromley insisted Meghan is sticking around for good and is not to blame for Harry's broken friendships as a result of his decision to settle down. Miss Bromley said, Meghan is sticking around for good. Here's the thing, Harry's life has changed dramatically. He was massively social on the London scene. He was a person that was holding parties, he was hanging around with Guy Pelly and all of these people that were just partying a lot. He has definitely stopped that. And I know that there are some friendships that have not necessarily survived while he has got married and there has been this change in his life. But this is normal. And it does annoy me that she is getting the blame for it because actually Harry is the one that decided it was it to settle down and fell in love. Meghan, 37, was also reportedly nicknamed Duchess Difficult by Palace staff after she bombarded her team with early morning texts. Speaking to Gail King in the CBS News special of Meghan and Harry Plus One, royal author Angela Levin explained, I think she is not popular in a lot of circles. It's often because they adore Harry and they seem to think that she is running the show. Since Meghan Markle joined the royal family, she has often been accused of being difficult and demanding. Last December, her personal assistant reportedly quit after working with the Duchess for just six months because of her diva-like attitude. In 2018 biography Charles at 70, Thoughts, Hopes and Dreams, author Robert Jobson claimed that before the royal wedding last May, Prince Harry raised his voice and yelled, what Meghan wants, she gets. But the US-born former Suits star's friends have also spoken out to defend her. American actress Janina Gavankar told CBS, she doesn't read the bad or the good because she knows the metrics that you have for your own life cannot be based on a headline that somebody else wrote. Meghan's makeup artist Daniel Martin broke down in tears as he spoke about the 37-year-old. He said, I know she doesn't deserve all of this negative press. What's so frustrating is that you hear these stories and there's no truth to them. It's not the same person. In the years I've known her, the years I've worked with her, she's never had a diva fit, never. He is the one that made these changes. But because she is an outsider, it's so easy to blame her. Meghan and Prince Harry, 34, this month welcomed their first child Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor, born on Monday May 6, weighing in at 7 pounds 3 ounces when the baby boy, called Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor, was just two days old. The royal couple introduced him to the world in a touching photo call. When answering questions from reporters, Harry joked the baby had already got a little bit of facial hair while Meghan said baby Archie had been a dream.